is a triple threat match for the WWE Championship. I feel great. Introducing the first champion. Being accompanied to the ring by Paul Heyman from Chicago, Illinois, weighing 218 pounds, he is the current WWE Champion, C. M. Punk. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight marks. And the challenger from Sin City, weighing 291 pounds, right back. This year at pay-per-view, CM Punk is 3-0 in triple threat matches for the WWE title. Yeah, ever since winning the title, CM Punk has not lost a triple threat match, despite the champion being at a disadvantage in this type of contest. That's right, King. The first man to gain pinfall or submission will be the winner, meaning CM Punk doesn't even have to be involved in the decision to lose the title. King, I have to ask you, a lot of people have been talking all week long about CM Punk being paranoid headed into tonight, that perhaps tonight's the night that everything comes crashing down for Punk. Do you believe these rumors? Well, the pressure of carrying that championship one day away from being a year? Of course he's nervous. CM Punk gathering attention in a hurry. Cole, what you got in mind? He's putting those educated feet to good use. Hey, now! King, prior to tonight, Survivor Series has hosted 17 WWE Championship matches. Ten of those 17 matches resulted in a new champion being crowned. Including a six-year stretch between 1994 and 1999, where a new champion was crowned every single year. But this is a different animal, King. This is triple threat rules. These matches are mayhem. This has Triple H. The game lost his WWE title to Edge in a triple threat match at this very event in 2008. John Cena tweeted earlier this evening about strategy. What do you do? Do you try to take Ryback out early? Well, to do that, King Cena may have to form an alliance with his arch enemy CM Punk. Given what they've been through in the past, I'd be shocked to see a Cena-Punk union. Well, whatever your strategy is. Oh, uh, look at Punk. Punk's trying to get Cena to tap out here. He may have to. And if Cena taps out, oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 the big guy, Ryback. Oh, my gosh. He he picks CM Punk up like a feather. Right back, slammy Punk. And now Cena from behind. Planning right Ryback, and Cena's, look at, oh my God. Look at Ryback, he's right back up already. Cena can't believe it, neither can I. That had absolutely no effect on Ryback, and now it's a slugfest. And the problem here is Punk's out of the equation, King. He could lose the championship, not even, not even be involved in the decision. Cena with some momentum. Uh -oh. Speaking of Punk. Watch out those steps. Oh! Well, those are the dangers of a triple threat match. CM Punk waiting on the outside, pulled Cena out, and then slammed John right into those metal steps. Man, DDT'd right on his face. Last week on Raw, we saw Ryback decimate road referee Brad Maddox in a match that could have rewarded Maddox with a $1 million contract had he won. Yeah, right. Brad Maddox beating Ryback would have been like Brooklyn Brawler beating Hulk Hogan. It was just never going to happen. Or like me beating you. Most importantly, Ryback was able to gain some level of retribution, but I don't think this animal is going to be satisfied until he's WWE Champion. 
you know, both John Cena and Ryback have a beef with CM Punk. And I don't think it would be smart for either one of them to turn their back on the WWE Champion at any point in this matchup. In this type of matchup, you need to have eyes in the back of your head. You never know where the next attack is going to... Went for the AA. And now Ryback's got Cena up. Looking for shell shock here. Ryback marching around the ring. Shell oh. shock for Cena. We had a new champion. We had a new champion. Hey, wait, 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 wait. What is this? What is going on here? Assaulting Ryback. Who are these guys? The King, wait, wait a minute. That, that looks like Roman Reigns from NXT. And is that Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins? I think so. Yeah, it is. What are they doing? And assault and Ryback. Reigns and Ambrose and Rollins. Look out, King, get out of the way, King. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Can you believe this? Ryback was going to be champion, but these NXT upstarts have ruined his night. CM Punk retains the championship. CM Punk has survived again. Oh my God. You know, I'm not really sure what just happened here tonight. What I can tell you, ladies and gentlemen, is that these three men dressed in black with security equipment on rushed the ring and assaulted John Cena and Ryback. They came out here and stood next to us at our announce table. And it was plain as day that these men are from our developmental group, NXT. You're right. These three men, Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, and Seth Rollins, may have impacted the long-term history of WWE here tonight.